This is the Rebloom Solar Wireless Outdoor Security Camera. Let's take it out of the box. In the box you get the quick start guide. Here is the camera itself along with its mounting bracket, bag of screws and wall anchors, and a template for mounting the bracket to make it real easy. Over here is the solar panel along with its mounting bracket bag with screws and wall anchors and again a template for mounting that and also a security sticker that you can put on your window or something like that. Yes ladies and gentlemen this is the wireless security camera that is truly wireless. This is the one that everybody dreamed of. It exists. Here it is and there are some caveats. The caveat that you're really going to come into is that it is solar and that's why they include a charging cable for USB to USB-C. Now I'm sure it's going to do a fine job but if you have a stretch of those really 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 cold long dark dreary days in the winter thieves these days are a lot smarter than they used to be. If they see this solar panel which obviously will be right outside they might know that you have a solar security camera and therefore its battery may be dead and they may be able to commit a crime at or near your property and your camera's battery may be dead. Now we're gonna hope that doesn't happen of course and the likelihood of it happening is probably pretty slim because solar panels have gotten a lot better than they have been uh, in the past but just know that wireless is really a dirty word in that sense. Of course, it also connects up wireless, so if your internet or Wi-Fi isn't that great, you have to get the wireless issues corrected before it's going to work at its top efficiency. Let me tell you a bit about the camera, then we'll go ahead and set it up. The camera is 2K resolution, that's 2048 by 1536. It's PTZ, Pan Tilt Zoom. It can pan 355 degrees, tilt 90 degrees, and has a 4x digital zoom. The camera has night vision. Color night vision with the spotlights built in is possible. And also, of course, has motion detection. It also has two-way audio. So you could yell at the thief saying, stop breaking into my car, at which point he'll look up the camera, look up at the camera and laugh at you because you're not home. Uh, it is Alexa compatible, so you can have uh, that, if you have one of the ones with the screen, you can have that display what's going on at your front door, or your back door, or wherever you put it, something like that. Also has a siren built in. It's solar powered, like I said, has a 9700 milliamp hour battery. It uses the Cloud Edge app for you to view the camera. Uh, and for storing video, it accepts up to a 128 gigabyte card. No card is included. Or you can sign up for cloud storage with it as well. The card would go under this panel in the bottom right there, like that. So with that being said, let me go ahead, get everything set up here, and we'll test it out. Camera's plugged in and turned on. We're going to hit the plus button over here and choose battery camera press and hold the device power button to start the device that I've done already we'll hit next we have to allow Please reset the device by holding the reset button for five seconds and now reset the, the device indicator light to flash red it's already reset and the light is flashing Select a 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi network and enter your password. Let me get the right network. Please remove all film from the lens. Tap next to show a QR code and let your device scan the code. Keep your phone 5 to 8 inches from the lens. We'll hit next. There's a QR code. Picked it up right away. tone will be heard Please it said up. so it made the cuckoo sound <laughs> it's already there that's fantastic there we go 
Uh, it says please use the power adapter to fully charge it before using it, which is USB like I said. We'll hit next, next, next. Tells you where to mount it, etc. And phone at the place of camera installation. Press next to enter network diagnostic. And there it is. And there it is. You can see me and hear me. See me and hear me. I think we'll leave that as the defaults. And there we are with the live picture. And there we are with the live picture. With sound. If I pick that up, I pick that up, and look at me, there I am. And look at me, there I am. And look at me, there I am. Let's turn the audio off. In fact, we'll try the hold to talk. We have to allow it. Talking through the phone. Drop that, thief. So it works. Here's just a quick video clip of what you can expect from the camera. I recorded this through the app on the phone. Hello, I'm on camera. So here's a mock-up of the installation. Solar panel, you can adjust that to the angle that you need. The wire would run down to the camera itself. The camera can be mounted anywhere as long as it's within reach of this wire so if you get better exposure on the side of the house sun exposure on the side of the house instead you can mount this elsewhere something like that so far thoroughly impressed the setup process could not have been easier I have dealt with many of these wireless cameras and some of them just you can try them 56 times and they just don't work the way it's supposed to and then on the 57th time it works barely this walk you through it's set up it just plain worked out of the box that is the kind of simplicity that we need in life these days everything is so complicated you need a phone just to say hello to somebody that you meet on the street <laughs> it's gotten so complicated this made it so simple to set up. I'm thoroughly impressed with that already. But for right now, let me show you more about the camera and what it can do and stuff like that. So there's a few things that we can do. You can turn your motion detection on and off. We'll turn that off for now because otherwise it's going to keep giving me notifications because obviously you can set that. Um, that was a lot of notifications. Now you can set up dead zones and stuff like that, but you know, that whole thing. So right, we've seen the audio back and forth through it. Like I said, PTZ. So now you have this. If I press that, you can see that it will pan. Now it's looking at the board and the wire will pan around the other way. There I am. We'll come back to about there. Pretty good. And then you can go up and down. I think that's all the way up and down, which goes a lot further because obviously you're going to mount the camera high up. So you can see it can look almost straight down. In fact, that is the board that it's mounted to right there. So we can do that come back up and you could zoom as well there's a light on it which I'll show you in more detail in a bit siren now I'll go for 30 seconds or you could stop it audio warning and strobe light and all kinds of stuff like that. Let me show you the light on it. There you go. So the light turns on. You can have it automatically turn that on at night. That, of course, is going to use the battery faster. But it's an option. 
and that is required for full color night mode but if you're okay with black and white then you can simply turn it off you can also flash those and sound the siren if it detects motion and bother the neighbors and all kinds of great stuff like that so it's absolutely fully functional all around the ability to have a truly wireless camera where you don't have to plug it in to AC power because that's really that's that is one of the main factors that prevents people from getting cameras there's no reason they're inexpensive enough these days that there's no reason and especially with all the crazies out in the world uh, which have um, quadrupled in the last year <laughs> uh, there's no reason not to own a camera and one of the biggest stumbling blocks for people is I have no way to power it nowhere to plug it in anything like that and there were others that they had with separate removable battery packs that you would then have to remember to charge and you forget about it for three weeks and then something happens and the battery's dead well it's a recharge solar now we discussed that earlier but you got a shot at it and probably a good shot at it uh, the only thing is it is conspicuous like I said thieves are a lot smarter these days. I don't know how they got smarter because you look at people these days and you really wonder how they got that far but the thieves are smart <laughs> they'll see that and know that this is completely wireless and on cloudy days you know they might be able to commit a crime like I said but all around fully functional excellent all around it just plain works out of the box walk you through the installation if you need a camera excellent choice right there there's no reason not to once again this was the rebloom solar wireless outdoor security camera if you'd like to purchase this item I'll leave a link in the video description to where you can find this item available for sale on Amazon thanks for watching make sure you click like make sure you click subscribe and take care we'll see you next time bye bye